Hey up guys, Brave Leonar here and welcome to episode number 6 of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Blue Rescue Team playthrough. Uh, we're here in the last episode, we went and we saved Metapod from Sinister Woods? Sinister Woods. Um, and we also took on Team Meanies who are oh so mean and we quite happily, uh, well, kicked their ass to be honest. Um, we recruited a Ladibur, I believe. And, yeah, we're here now. I've quickly scouted ahead to see whether anything happens. And, thankfully, there's plot straight away. I've not done anything since the last episode. So, let's get started. Leon, good morning. Let's do good again today. Um, hello. Huh? who could that be? It's Rescue Team Lee and Ha here. That's right. Huh? Wait, aren't you? Please, I'm my friend. Please, I need help. Forget it. We're not about to work for that. But my friend needs a gust of wind, please. I remember now. Jump off, we saw you in Pokemon Square. We were Shifty agreeing to take on your rescue job. Yes. But Shiftry, he hasn't come back yet from the rescue mission. What? Are you serious? My friend Jumpluff got wedged between some rocks. Listen to this music. Something dramatic is definitely happening. My friend Jumpluff got wedged between some rocks. We Jumpluff can go anywhere if we catch a wind, but... Even though the skies are filled with thunderclouds, for some odd reason, the winds haven't blown. Not even a breeze? This is strange. Shiftry's leafy fans can whip up powerful winds. We thought Shiftry's wind would be able to dislodge our friend, but... But Shiftry hasn't returned. Doesn't sound like all that challenge of a rescue, challenging of a rescue mission. It is strange. Oh? That's the spirit, Leon. Your expression tells me you're ready. Okay, then. We'll go look for them. Really? Thank you. No problem. You can count on us. Let's go, Leon. Get get out of my way. Okay. Um. Are we... Are we ready to take this on? I think we are. Level 13. Level 15. I think we're ready to take on. Because we didn't really struggle with the the main enemies in um, Sinister Woods. So wherever we're going now, I don't think we're going to struggle. Let's bring Polarity a a along with us again because I quite like Polarity. He's doing some, some, good, uh, some good work for the team. Uh, we'll quickly go and see if we can buy any more friend areas. And then we'll, I'll go and store our items in that. Uh, I'll take this. Take the savings. Nope. One oh, wiggly tough. Now, because I do know what's coming. Um, there's none there. I'm going to get Thunder Meadow, because I know, I don't think it's this one, but I think it's the next, the next area is filled with uh, electric types. Uh, Magnetic Quarry has only got Beldum. Ravage Field, Spearer, Mount Discipline is for fighting types. Decrepit Lab. Um, I would love a Beldum on my team. I would love a Beldum on my team. I've already been to the place where you can get Belden, but I'm gonna get I'm gonna get Magnetic Quarry. Seems like a waste actually. I should have perhaps not got Magnetic Quarry then. But never mind, never mind. We're really rattling through those uh, those uh, friend places, friend areas. Oh, that's because that, that's been used, doesn't it? Yeah. Uh, I'll keep a, an apple. 
and a couple of orum berries. Yeah, we'll put them in storage. Yeah, keep a couple of reviver seeds as well. I don't think we'll need them, to be honest. So I've been and got polarity. Uh, polarity is uh, level 9 or something now, isn't it? Yeah. But he's got such... He's got two... You get two abilities. Wow, okay. I didn't know that. So what's... Nigel's just got Blaze. I'm guessing I've just got Torrent, yeah. Okay, that's cool. The Silent Chasm. Let's give it a go. Let's just go for it. Silent Chasm. So you can see on the map, uh, on the top, right next to where Silent Chasm is, you can see what's coming up. Wow, this cliff is steep! Your friend Jump Off is lost deep in this canyon? Yes, I'm sorry to ask, but please. It'll be fine. Let's go, Liam. Wait. Yes, what is it? There's something I forgot to mention. This canyon is known as the Silent Chasm, but... It's ruined that an amazing monster sleeps here. M monster? Yes, but... It's only folklore. It's also true that Shifty hasn't returned. I just thought I should let you know. Ah, uh, well, oh, my stomach, it hurts. Oh, what's wrong? It's my stomach is suddenly cramped up. Oh, 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 I think my breakfast was spoiled or something. Say, Leon, you're feeling sick too, aren't you? Leon, your stomach hurts too, doesn't it? No, I'm perfectly fine. Uh. What's the matter, Leon? I need you to back me up. If you're my partner, you need to read my cues better. Why this sudden outburst, Nigel? Don't you have stomachache? Huh? Uh, yes. Oh, I guess the cramping settled down. <laughs> so anyway, you said there may be a monster. What's he like? I don't know very much at all. It's just an old folk tale. I wouldn't know if it existed or not. Okay. Well, it can be helped. Let's just hope that monster doesn't exist. My friend Jimbluff should be around basement 10 floor. <laughs> basement floor 10. That's actually shorter than Sinister Woods, so that's good. Please take care. Okay, gotcha. Let's get going, Leon. Okay, so... We could probably explore a little bit as well. Ten floors. I've got an apple. I'm going to have to explore this floor anyway, because I, I haven't got the stairs immediately for me. I like this music. There's a gloom in here. Okay. That's fine. Another apple. Okay. Didn't find anything else. I'm not... Yeah, I'm going to... I'm not going to go straight for the stairs if they're in the same room as me. Ooh, a Weedle. Bop. Yanme. Can I get a Yanmega? Ooh. He lived that. And he gave great experience. Okay, that's cool. That's great, actually. Teddy Ursa picked up a warp orb. Dwarf Teddy Ursa. Far fetched! Okay, they're surviving the Leah Scratch standard attack combo that has been killing everything so far. Magnemite's HP just goes up so much. Okay, so 58 already. Bear in mind, he's like five levels lower than Nigel. He's, uh, his HP is great. Um, can I? I can. And then, moves. Water gone. Use. Ha! <laughs> oh, 
Ooh, Nigel. Okay. So I've taken a bit of damage. I'm okay though. I'm okay. Oh. Take on this teddy here, sir. You lick on me. I'm quickly going to run out of PP. Oh. I might have to just stand and heal for a bit. Come on, Polarity. You can do better than that. Thank you. I'm just going to go straight down the stairs because Polarity's gone wandering off and he's technically my weakest member. Although, I only really an attack. Defensively, he's pretty good. He doesn't take any damage. Oh, he would use quick attack, wouldn't he? Have I taken exclusive move user off these guys? Check IQ. No, I've still got exclusive move user on. No mad. Ooh, a dust ox. It's a little bit scary. That should be good experience. 105. Yamma gets more. There's another dust ox, but he's running away. This one's asleep. Oh. Yeah, sometimes the controls don't really work. You end up going past them, but never mind. Okay, where's the exit to this floor? Is it all the way over there? Let me guess that it's all the way. Down here. They say sometimes the controls don't work. Ooh, confusion could do a lot. No, leave me alone. There it is, at long last. Take the aura and berry. Ooh, no. Okay, four five. Polywag. See you later, Polywag. I'd like a polywag. Not recruited anything. I don't know whether that's because I've not got the the correct things or let's have a look. You can you can look up recruitment search. Weedle Gloom Polywag and Yanme. So yeah. I could have recruited all of those yammers. Oh no. See that should wake me up. Die. Hey, level up. HP went up by four. Very nice. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay. Gloom. Gloom could do a lot. As we know from the red nuzlocke, Gloom puts in the work. Petuni has betrayed me. Get it, get, get, get in there, steps. Okay. Floor six. Hound hour. Oh, I'd love a hound hour. And a trap inch. Okay. 
Beautiful. This looks like now a good time to swap my I was about to say that's gonna do nothing, Magma. Why would you do that? Yeah, I can I, you can uh, later on when you get start getting like gummies and stuff. I'm gonna swap water gun. Because that was a trap inch and a hound hour, both of which are gonna take a lot of damage from water gun. Getting hungry. Okay. Hungry, hungry, hungry. Eat an apple. Apples never fail me. I suppose it'd be different if there was pizza available. Pizza would fail me. Basement floor 7. Okay, let's go down this way. Well, up this way. What am I doing? Now that I've put water gun up front, I'm going to come across a gloom which resists water gun. That's good. Never mind. It still did about as much damage as the Leah ta uh, the Leah scratch combo was doing. So, said this way, Paris. All these cool Pokemon. Watch me get a Paris. You could have done like a hundred damage easily with. Ember there. Nigel, and you choose to use Tackle. Okay. I don't actually think you can increase the IQ of Nigel until you uh, complete the game. Because then you can start doing things like evolving Pokemon, you can... Um, you don't have to take your partner on missions. I think you still have to go. I might, I might even be wrong there, to be honest. As I say, it's going to have water absorb, isn't it? Yay! Poliwag wants to join the team. And it's got water absorb as well, which is really cool. Po give Poliwag a nickname. Um, what can I give Poliwag a nickname? Uh, the tadpole Pokemon becomes Poliwhirl and Poliwrath. Um, try and think of something like with. Spyros or something. Spy spiro spirals. Oh uh, yeah, I said Spyro then, didn't I? I? Like a bit of Spyro. Um as a kid I used to play with these all the time. And uh, Spyro Graph. Yeah, I used to play with them, these things all the time. You know them? Uh, oh, it just fits. You know them things where you put the pen in, in the... the uh, like the, It's like a gear thing, and you put your pen in and it does circles. Yeah, I used to use them all the time. I was, uh, I was uh, a fun kid. I had, I had lots of friends. <laughs> oh, well, Nigel's going to get lost if I go down there, so let's not do that. Nigel's still getting lost anyway. Dumb idiot. Right. Oh, okay. I, I can't be bothered to go and explore the rest of us. Oh, let's explore over here. There's got to be something over here. Nigel's getting... in some attacks. There you go. Do it properly. Spirograph's already level 10 as well, so that's good. On par with the uh, with polarity. Ooh, I've been slowed. So every movement that I take, everybody else takes two. Whoa, 82 damage with Ember. 
Great stuff. Alright, uh, I'm just going to go to the stairs. Oh, somebody spawned. It's a polywag. Use Thundershot po polarity. Oh, never mind. Spirograph levels up. I love polywag. I'm kidding. Those stat increases were awful. But, okay. Let's head in here. Floor 9. That means we're almost at the end of this. We got told that jump off was it on floor ten, so that normally means there's no nothing to do on floor ten, just story. Yeah. Ooh. There we go, and we got the paralysis and spirograph coming through. Okay. There we go. Oh. Alright. Plot time! Isn't this a place where Jumpless Friend is supposed to be? It's perfectly fine. Oh, hey! We came for you, are you alright? Yes, I'm fine, but... Great, your friend is waiting for you. Shiftry is in the back. Huh, Shiftry? Let's go. Oh no, what's happened? Listen, are you okay? Snap out of it! Uh, forget about me. Get away from here. Get... Get away? What's going on? Why did it turn pitch black? It's coming. It's gonna be like the Skarmory voice, this is. <laughs> Riverside, you! He dared to disturb my sleep. I have no mercy for meddlers, and that includes you. Shifty's gone. I'm Zapdos, the embodiment of lightning. If you wish to save Shifty, then scale Mount Thunder. Yeah. Yeah. Zapdos, so that's the legendary monster. Yay, saved! I'm so happy! But even though I'm safe, Shifty is in trouble. Please tell us exactly what happened. Yes, Shifty whipped, whipped up the wind. <laughs> Shifty whipped up the winds with his fans and released me from between the rocks. But those winds tore a thundercloud in too. And that was when that monster appeared in the sky. That monster? It said it was Zapdos. I'm gonna guess Alakazam. Did you say Zapdos? Haha, <laughs> yeah! Alakazam! Zapdos. It's one of the legendary bird Pokemon. I heard it had been sleeping for a long time. So Shiftry woke it up? No. Shiftry's winds were only the trigger. To begin with, the absence of winds there was unnatural. It must have been caused by the rash of natural disasters recently. Zapdos is enraged from having been woken from his sleep. Shiftry must be saved. The Zapdos won't be easy. Its electric attacks are wicked nasty. I know that. We will need to be cautious. We'll go too. We'll go help Shiftry. What? This is dangerous. Zapdos is powerful. It will be too much for your skill level. Hey! We're not that weak! Besides, Zapdos doesn't scare us. Right, Leon? I'm not scared. I am not scared of a Zapdos. I'm a water type and I will take a hell of a lot of damage from it. But I've got Reviver Seeds. Have you ever been hit with an electric blast? It'll leave you stunned and shaking. No problem. Zapdos is wickedly tough. It might gobble you off for a snack. Can you face that? I'm not scared. We're a rescue team too. We want to help Shiftry. Fine. I see that you have courage. Yeah! 
our two teams should make our way separately through Mount Thunder. We will go when we have geared up for battle. Knowing how strong our opponent is, we have no choice but to be cautious. You should make way for Mount Thunder only when you are fully prepared. Our objective is to rescue Shiftry. Let us find success. Yes! I'm getting excited over this! Leon, let's do our best! Fist pump! Love a good fist pump. Uh, yeah. PG! Oh, I didn't save them. Next morning. Cool. Alright then. So, we're going to leave the episode off there. We've gone and saved Jumpluff. And we've had Shiftry kidnapped. So at least we know that next time we can just come in and there will be straight plot. We can scale Mount Thunder and go and rescue Shiftry. I might do a little couple of trips through a few places because I'm a little bit worried. I'm a water type. Mm, I'm going to take a lot of damage from these things. So, yeah, and there's going to be a lot of electric types in there, I'm guessing. So, with that, guys, I'm going to end the episode off here. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you soon. Stay brave, guys.